Hello, my fiery Sagittarius says, let's have a peek at your person. Thank you all for stopping by. Spirit of me, love and love it. It's your girl Stardust here. Good morning, my lovelies. How are all of you doing out there? All right, so we're going to have a peek at your person. Just remind, remember that a spirit can be picking up on your energy as well. And cross watchers, this could resonate for you more than the person that you are watching for. So, Tarot's gender neutral. You're king to be queens and vice versa. Don't get too caught up on the genders here. Time is fluid. So, there's going to be events that have already happened that are currently taking place or that will happen for some of you guys here in the near future. All right. So... Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit the bell notification if you'd like to be notified the next time I upload some content over here on my YouTube channel for you lovely Sagittarius. Oh, somebody's watching. So we have four of swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, six of pentacles, three of cups, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces at the bottom. At the top, we have the Fool, Aquarius Energy, Eight of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Page of Swords, more Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, the Strength is Leo, and Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn for King of Pentacles. So I'm definitely seeing that you're taking the time that you need to rediscover your vitality here. You're in separation from your person here. Um, this person feels that they need to come back in here with reciprocity here with an equal give and take here. They see that you receive the things from the universe here. They want to embrace the joyful times and opportunities that you have going on currently right now in your life. They see that you're celebrating, that you're having a good time. You're enjoying yourself with friends and families. This person could be watching you on um, your social media. If you're a YouTuber or a blogger, they can be watching that or your Facebook page, Instagram, however you choose to social media, right? Um, the fool is telling me this person wants to come forward and take a leap of faith with you. They're guided and protected to come towards you. They feel like they're the one who should be by your side and accompany you in this journey called life right now. Um, they are very worried and in their head about it. Um, they want to release themselves from the um, inflicted binds, the self-inflicted binds that they have going on in their current life right now. This person thinks about you a lot. They obsess about you. I'm feeling here in that type of energy because you have the page of swords coming right after here, which is taking care of the detail. They want to stay in control, but they can't hold themselves back. They're always trying to find information about you. They're watching you online. They're watching your social media. They transformed a lot. They feel like they've learned a lot and enough about you that this person is going to come forward with confidence when you do see them because they, you know, it's kind of like watching what you like. Like if you are going to have a first date with this person, they're going to know your favorite type of flower you know, because they've seen it on your social media or your favorite dish or your favorite colors. Um, they're going to be able to incorporate that into a theme of something that they're working towards bringing towards you. I feel like the strength card here is uh, they see that you can deal with whatever comes your way. They see that you're very strong and that you embody this power of like um, the imprints, like the queen of all queens standing in her strength right now, standing in your power, being very powerful right now and prideful here. Your person can be very prideful. It could be why they're not running, charging in, but they're definitely watching you from afar here. And they want to take the risk to come in. They want to get something started with you. Um, they see that you're sure of your place in this world, but more than that, they're sure in their place in this world is with you. They want to come forward here. They want to be the father, a husband, a protector, a provider, a nurturer. They want to be that lion that you stroke, that you tame so well. This strength card here, this angel is so comfortable here in the presence of this otherwise deadly ferocious lion because she has just mastered her emotions so well and how to handle life situations and what's going on around her to the point that she is really unbothered by anything that does not serve her. And she's only interested in making harmonious connections and relationships and even turning around those that could have come for her. It's like, if you throw this this person feels like with you, um, if you throw you into the pack of wolves, you're you're going to come back leading them. You know what I'm saying? Like that type of strength. They see that you embody and they've already decided they want to come in and be the ones who accompany you on this journey here. Holding this pentacle very close to their heart is how they want to show up and hold and nurture and protect and provide for you. This person is very smitten with you. <laughs> very, very good energy I see here for you guys. Sag, very good energy. So what messages do we have for our Sagittarians for the Energy Oracle deck? What messages do we have for the Sagittarians for the Energy Oracle deck? Spirit.
messages from the energy on the deck. Woman holding a coin. Door to romance. I'm gonna get you guys one more card. From the energy oracle. Spirit. Wow. <laughs> Okay, so, wow, okay, guys, too much, too much. There's a lot going on here and door to value. I saw it, I'm taking it, guys. This is legit crazy, good crazy, though. This person wants to come in bringing so much your way. This king of pentacles are showing up here twice. Like, yes, I'm the one, period. What you need, mommy, I can upgrade you. What you need, I got that. Even if this person don't got that in the bank, like when they get paid, they got that. This ain't got to be somebody that's got a whole shitload of money, but they're showing up with what they got and they're showing up to impress. This person's showing up here, man holding the coin. They're already the king of pentacles coming your way, right? Want to bring in something to you that's tangible here. This person sees you as the one that they want to accompany on this life journey. They see your value and worth and they want to help you grow your bag. This person sees you as the one, the divine counterpart here, power couples, period. All right? Sag, and I see here that they see you're very loving, nurturing, protective. Here, a woman holding the heart. They know that you have a lot of love to give. And they also see that your heart can be kind of protected right now. But they want to hold the key to your heart. They want to unlock and uncage that heart there. But they definitely see there's an opening here at some point for them to come in. Whether this is a situation where you're coming out of a situation. You've broken up from someone with that Eight of Swords energy. Or they just see that you're protected and guarded. And they're hoping just to get a little glimpse of what that heart looks like. So that they can begin to love on you and show you how... That energy that didn't serve you only prepared you for this bigger, better love that's coming your way. They hope you can handle all this love they have to give because they have a whole lot of love to give, right? Door to value. They see your worth. They want to grow with you. They want to build coins with you. This can be someone you're going to start a business with. It can be someone that you're currently working with or have a business with already. But they definitely see a lot of value in you here with daughter romance, woman holding the heart. You got the king of pentacles and a woman and man holding the coin with the daughter value. This relationship, situation is going to be very prosperous, very abundant for you and your person here. They want to come in and they want to, you know, bring you to business. You're ruled by the planet of Jupiter here. So they see you as very expansive. They see the luck in you. They see that divine star that you were born under, that abundance, that luck, that good fortune, that spirituality, that expansion. They want to be a part of that. I hope someone got what they needed from this reading. Thank you all so much for joining me, Sag. Your reading was lit and on fire. I'm loving it. Thank you so much. Bye.